Hi everyone. So let's talk about one important query that is how to concatenate more than two columns in SQL. So it's very important actually. So real time also it's very very important. So just understand how to concatenate more than two columns in SQL. So actually, so let's consider this is a data and this is my input and my expectations is this. So what is I'm doing here? I have three columns here, first name, last name or middle name and last name. And we are converting into full name, only one column here. So many people think that for this requirement, everybody will think that concatenate function will use. So let's say you take one example here, right? select concat of now you can say then Arjun then we'll take ready so I have taken two expression as name from dual table for understanding purpose so it is going to work for two columns and these two columns that you need to understand so that exactly what the concatenation function will do so when we have three parameters so two parameters it's okay but it won't accept more than two and it is not going to give any space or any special characters that we cannot pass so let me try here so now hash then see here it is showing that invalid number of arguments. So many people think that for this requirement concatenation function will work. But concat function will not work for this requirement. It's a real time task as well. So if you go for any project and this task is mandatory. So now what we need to do for this requirement. We are going to use pipe symbol a pipe operator we are going to use it. So how we are going to do that? So let's see here. You take the requirement. Okay. Now here select. Okay. Then whatever the ID. Then the next one you you are we are doing like three columns as one column in the target. So now you need to use like. Let's say I'll go ahead with the logic basis here yes so first name okay then pipe symbol and here separator with the hash value then again middle name then hash value again okay and then we have last name so we can consider as a full name this okay then after this we have salary from the or from table or you can say whatever the table employee so this is what we need to write it for the question that we have asked the answer is this so you can understand carefully this question. So whenever we are doing like selecting and these three columns are working as a one column that is full name salary and then so the output will come if you use the query like this. So let me take one small example with the two select. Okay, then you take one small example like uh, Arjun then then here I'm doing hash symbol then again I'm doing ready and again I'm using B here so as full name okay then from dual so same like this somewhere let's go ahead okay sorry for that we have to give 
pipe symbol and uh, inverted inside hash value then again this then from to you sorry okay sorry Arjun we have not given because if you are taking from if you are taking from the values like a dual table you can pass actual value strings only when you are taking from the table then you use column names okay see this Arjun hash ready hash b so what do you need to understand here you are passing multiple values so you cannot pass more than one value in concat function okay concat function we cannot use it so for this requirement it's a real time requirement the solution is this okay you need to give proper answer for that to get output so pipe operator is the best example when you are adding with concatenating with the three or two more than two actually okay but you can able to give hash value you can able to give space you can you can able to give a thread symbol whatever you can pass in in between these columns okay this is real time and practical interview question as well as real time concept okay guys so thank you very much in the next class we'll see with a new scenario thank you